Firewall coming out was really surreal for us. Out of the gate, we definitely had a lot of positive reception from what we've experienced in game, from what we've experienced through social platforms and keeping tabs on community pulse. It has really just continued to grow since then. We have different communities all over the world. It's really rewarding that all of this effort has been appreciated by so many people. I like to play the game too at home, hearing what people say. It gives us the drive we need to make better maps, make better features. I think we hit something here and people love it. When you move away from that. Spiral Zero Hour is a 4v4 PSVR first person shooter online multiplayer game. VR gives this whole new dimension of scale. I feel like because it's a VR game, people have this sense of presence when they're inside the game with everyone. Feedback from the community helps a lot because we're able to see it from another person's perspective. You know, it just has to be rewarding for them at the end. We compile weekly reports from social posts, top 10 players, what they like, what they don't like. We want to continue expanding the universe and shaping and evolving the game based off of community feedback. You know, we got to find ways to keep it fresh and keep it interesting and keep pushing the boundaries. Nightfall is a global operation. It's going to last 12 weeks within Firewall's universe. We wanted to create more meaningful ways to play the game. So part of that is the missions, two new maps, two new contractors, three new weapons, and the rewards that come with those. Operation Nightfall is an entire new expansion, basically, on our game. This is much more in line with what we're doing in the future and how we're going to be pressing forward. There's going to be more depth to the gameplay. There's going to be a brand new UI. I mean, as soon as you boot up the game, you're going to notice that something different has happened. And then it'll set up cadence for moving into the next seasons after Nightfall and on into the future. And I think people are really going to like that. The Sandstorm environment in FOB is one of my favorite things that we've done. Compositionally, it was interesting because atmosphere is something that we always use in art to sort of help frame things and add depth. We're trying to tie the maps together with some familiar branding and logos. You know, what's the connection between all these maps? We're not explicitly telling you what's going on. Maybe we will later. But until then, we kind of want to leave it up to the community to kind of come up with their own storylines and see if they can figure it out. We're looking forward to seeing you guys online in Operation Nightfall. For the players.